Hi guys, how are you this morning? So we'll continue our series. As you can see, my hair is not done. No, it's very difficult to do your hair in these situations. Um, so this is to all these judges. We'll start with them. Um, Felix Katina, Judge Katina, Mr. Katina, I don't know, what do you call his holiness, his highness, his, the honorable, I wouldn't go there. But anyway, um, this is what these judges do to people, women. This is economic abuse. Okay, so today is cleaning day. So I go to use the washer and dryer and, um, well, the washer's broken or the dryer's broken, but the washer's making noise. So I call downstairs and right away I get a snotty remark about the numbers because somebody put a sign on it, but they didn't call downstairs. So of course it'll look like I broke the washer and dryer. This is after having new washer and dryers in all my rentals, in my home, ready to put it in up to the lake house so I would be set for hard times because hard times were coming. As you can see, people can't afford housing, they can't afford food, and this is what these good old boy judges watching QAnon all day do up to the lake. And this is what, what he did throughout high school with his little clique, with all the superstars that played football and um, you know the rest of the, the little brat pack that continues to do this to, to women like me just because we didn't have children, just because we don't live the life that he, uh, they you know demand that you live, even though my ex-husband wasn't exactly Mr. Patriarchal Perfect either. So, oh, oh, let me show you this. Oh, this is off the floor after a week. Look at this, after a week, okay? That's the floor, okay? And you've seen the floor in some of the other videos. So th this is the type of environment you're living in. Forget about your hair, forget about getting up and, you know, maybe going to an activity because, or a festival or a class even, because the CEO here doesn't want anything to do with me, even though I had reached out to her because I thought maybe it'd be a good idea to, to update my skills again, again, and maybe take something with domestic violence, but that's not gonna happen here now. So after all the harassment for the last few days, it's pretty exhausting. And, you know, I'd like to do something other than trying to deal with broken washers and dryers too. You know, after working all 20 years to make sure that I could do a nice load of wash because I can go through my childhood abuse and how it was doing six loads of wash every week and hanging stuff out in the winter time. But we'll table that for today. But so we'll start this thing about this is... The law is 50-50, but this is what these judges continue to do uh, to women like me. Be safe, guys, and hope your laundry is coming out a whole lot better than mine today. Take care.